first thought it was going to be a little bit hectic at that time of the year uh, because of everything that's going on. You know, but uh, we were able to get some guys signed, guys that were committed, guys that knew they wanted to come to Carolina. They weren't interested in doing, uh, do, uh, having any more of the recruiting process. Uh, their families were tired of it, so they wanted to get it done. So that was a good thing, was being able to take care of that. Now, what happens then at that point was I, I didn't realize the, uh, you know, the intensity level will ju would just, uh, uh, you know, increase on the rest of the kids that was out there. And I mean, it was like the pool was much smaller and everybody was all over those guys. And so, uh, you know, on top of that, the, the, the other good part about it was you were able to start focusing in on some of the 2019 guys. So you were able to get to a lot of schools and, uh, you know, talk to a lot of coaches at that time. You know, for the head coaches, I mean, we're not on the road in the spring. So it uh, was almost throwing you back to uh, the first year I became a head coach, where the year before that, the head coaches could be out in the spring. Well, I, di I never had that opportunity, so this was the first time I was actually out there talking to high school coaches about the 2019 class.